Hey crypto bros and sisters, welcome back to the channel as always. If you're new to the channel, please accept my invitation to join our crypto fam by hitting the thumbs up and subbing to the channel only if you gain any value from today's content. All right guys, let's jump right into some crypto news. Tax season will soon be upon us and I know a lot of you guys buy and trade crypto. I just wanted to go over some basic tax rules when it comes to crypto. Disclaimer, I'm not a tax professional. Please do your own due diligence when it comes to your own taxes guys. So let's say that you converted your Bitcoin to Ethereum, guys. Even though you didn't technically cash out in USD, you are still required to pay taxes if your Bitcoin had appreciated in value. You just don't get to convert in between cryptos and not pay Uncle Sam his share. Another crypto tax tip would be if you got airdropped 10 Bitcoins and each Bitcoin was worth $10,000, guys. Airdrops are typically taxed at a fair market value of the receipt. So that 100K you receive is not 100K, believe it or not. Even if you sold those 10 Bitcoins the next day for $90,000, you would still report an income of $100,000 and a capital loss of $10,000, guys. Since the IRS only allows you to deduct $3,000 of capital losses every year. In this scenario, you can roll over the remaining $7,000 in future years. Don't we all just love taxes, guys? Your crypto taxes also change depending if you held your crypto longer than a year, guys. If you held it for one year or longer, that's called long-term capital gains. And short-term capital gains would mean if you sold your crypto under a year. These numbers of tax percentages will change depending on if you're married or single and make a certain amount of money for the year. The IRS is even considering taxing staking rewards as you get them in. These guys are just ruthless. The government tries to suck us dry with taxes only to end up sending it to other countries, guys. I wouldn't mind it as much if the money they took from us went to our communities in the states. Anyways, let me focus back up. Most crypto exchanges do send out tax forms that are needed to show the IRS what crypto you have sent, converted, and sold throughout the years, guys. Do not, and I repeat, do not try to dodge your crypto tax. The IRS can and has ordered exchanges to release trading history of customers before. Kraken and Coinbase, if I remember, were ordered by a judge to give customer information and trading history as far back as three to five years, guys. So don't think that these exchanges are going to fight for your privacy. They're not. If filing your crypto taxes seem too taxing, no pun intended, the best thing you can do is hire a professional tax accountant to make sure you're in compliance. The worst thing you could do, guys, is to lose track of what you owe and then get hit with a huge tax bill years later down the road. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to hit me up on TikTok at no cap crypto with two O's at the end. And if you're watching me on YouTube, you already know what to do to help your crypto bro out against these YouTube algorithms. Until next time.